About Vashav. <sighs> the man was taken captive by the Tanakh. Survived for years out in the West, only to die just short of the Sundom. It's a cruel end for a good soldier. What will happen to him? His body will be carried back to Meridian. As a cousin of the Sun King, he will be accorded official rights and buried with honor. No soldier could ask for more. You mentioned the Utara tribe. Their lands are between here and the Tanakh further west? That's right. Plainsong is their home. They're a peaceful bunch, at least compared to the Tanakh. More taken to farming than fighting. It's hard to imagine a bunch of farmers surviving in the Forbidden West. Make no mistake, they have a fierceness all their own. When the Karja were pushed back during the Red Raids, their warriors chased ours through the burning fields of Plainsong. The Sun King has made several overtures of peace to them as well, but so far, they've declined. If they're so peaceful, why decline? Don't know. I heard they have their own troubles to deal with. Something about a food shortage. You'd think that'd make them open to trade, but... No. They just want to be left alone. I need to be on my way. Then I wish you luck. The gates will always be open to you should you wish to return. And don't worry about your friends. We'll get them patched up. I appreciate it. Sun, watch over you, Aloy. I hope you find what you're looking for. frontier to explore. The coordinates from the spire should lead to silence in Hades. And just maybe a backup of Gaia. It won't be easy out there. The blight, the storms, Regal's machine riders. But I'll have to push through it all. Find a way to fix the world. Like Elizabeth would. the ambush, Regala, had a lot of machines under her command. There's only one other person who has that kind of knowledge. The silence. But what's his angle? Why help to knock the rebels? My stash later.
useful for making dyes. Taking over the land out here, too. Must be the salvagers I met in Baronlight. Looks like something's like going on. Buckets of scrap. You really think you can do that? Karuf, come on! You know me. Have I ever given you anything less than perfection? If it isn't the savior of Meridian, and of my very own operation. Laren, say hello. Hello, nice to meet you. You know, if it weren't for this one, I probably wouldn't be standing here right now. Oh, nasty business. What the Tanakh did back at the embassy. But everyone in Baron Light is thankful you drove them off. So this is your salvage operation? You won't find a better place to trade machine parts in the West. And soon we'll be trading in more than just that. For too long the West has been, well, forbidden. Dangerous. But. What if I told you we could make an armor so tough, so infallible, that you'd never have to worry about survival out here again? I'd be curious to take a look at it. Of course you would! <laughs> and that's why I've asked my most talented salvagers to find what they need to make that armor. Each of them will present their work to me. The best protection will go on sale to hunters, just like you. Lucky me. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have some business to attend to back in Chainscrape. Larand can take care of you while I'm gone. Can't wait to see what you come up with, my boy. Leave it to me. It'll blow all the others out of the forge. You have got to help me. What are you talking about? The armor. I made a dozen versions of it. But none of them were good enough. And there are other crews further west. 
If they make better armor than mine, I can kiss that keg full of shards goodbye. So you get a prize if Karif picks your armor? A big one. And I finally have the perfect design. I just need the right parts, and fast. So maybe you'd be willing to pick up a contract and get them for me? What would I be looking for? Shellwalker containers. Their plating's made to withstand a lot of damage. It'll make the perfect armor. I know it. I think I can handle that. Ah, oh, thank the forge. All right. We scouted out a herd near here. Here's the contract. It'll tell you everything you need to know. You take the machines down. My people will pick up the containers. Oh. Give this a closer look later. Thanks. Counting on you, Aloy. contract before going on the hunt. I had to slow down the Pharaoh's warp to buy Zero Dawn time. If it isn't the hero of the day. Sure I'm glad you came by when you did. Are you all Delvers? We've been working no man's land for a while. I was hoping to get back to Baron Light by the time they opened the gates, you know? After that embassy of theirs. Seeing as how we almost got minced to pieces just now, I'm guessing things didn't go so well. You could say that. It's not like no man's land was safe to begin with. But I didn't think I'd have to worry about the Sanak, the neutral territory. And now, they're riding machines! If you were headed back to Baron Light, why did you stop here? We ran across some ruins nearby. Thought we'd take a gander, find some good salvage. But the place is full of weird red crystals. Can't get through the stuff. So we ended up making camp here. First thing tomorrow, though, we head straight to Baron Light. Should probably send a message to our crew down at Jagged Deep about all this, too. Jagged Deep? It's a dig site by this big lake down south. Old world scrap everywhere. Can't miss it. <laughs> and that's my cue. Here. Thanks for helping us out. Maybe I'll get into more trouble and see you around. Well, let's hope not.
need these later, for sure. Once you're cooked. I could fire that machine with shock ammo. a pack of scrappers to curve up any salvage.
pretty sure that's the passage Laren's contract mentioned. I should make sure I have my facts straight. Give the contract a quick read. Showwalkers use this passage regularly, and Laren wants their plating. I just need to wait them out at his camp. It might be a good idea to place some traps on the road first. Catch the convoy by surprise. Wind is bracing. It looks like the coordinates Silence gave me match that wreckage. Did he install Hades on another Titan? This is it. Location of the coordinates I scanned from the spire. The workshop underneath a dead Horus Titan. Just the kind of place Silence would slink away to. But what was he doing here? That device is blinking. I guess Silence wants me to check it out. message a beacon to help guide you out of the fog of ignorance. Using explosives, I've detached the processing orb from the Titan overhead, a perfect cage for our mutual friend, Hades, in order to render it cooperative. Tell her what we discussed about the mysterious signal that gave you life. Perhaps you need a reminder that you have failed. 
So you see, Aloy, Gaia can be safely rebooted. As for where to find a backup, well, you'll need to trot along after me to find out. He thinks he's got it all figured out. Bastard. And I guess there's only one way to find out where he moved the orb. Might be worth looking around more first. Thank you. 